if you've been reading scripture for a while, my guess is you've kind of slipped into this process on your own. So the Contemplate Method actually has uh, four steps to the process. The first one is reading the passage. So just going over, being very familiar with the passage, getting to know what the passage is all about. Uh, and then as you've read through the passage a number of times, the next step uh, is the meditation step. And that step is to go through and find something in the passage that um, sometimes people say it kind of lights up or it just catches your attention. You go, oh, this is important to me. You, you stop there. And then the meditation process is you go over that one idea, it might be a phrase, it might be an image, and you just repeat it in your mind to kind of remember it, to keep it focused in on your mind. The third step is then to pray about that passage. So uh, if you've done this uh, and it's worked right, you've got a passage of scripture and then something in your life that connects to that scripture, and then you turn that into a prayer. Uh, and you talk to God about this that's going on in my life is talked about in this passage. And you talk to God about that. Uh, and then the fourth uh, step in this process is really to uh, just be quiet and know that God is there with you and to enjoy his presence, which is very hard to do at first. Take some practice and those four steps make up the contemplative uh, practice of engaging scripture.